5 weather alert. Hello and thanks so much for joining us for News 5 at 6. Fires in both El Paso and Pueblo counties are forcing people out of their homes tonight. Two separate fires are burning in Pueblo County right now. Take a look. We've been bringing you live coverage all afternoon. The Vision Hills wildfire is burning on the north side of Pueblo County. This fire is north of Highway 47 between Fountain Creek and Walking Stick Golf Course. A separate fire is burning right now at the Everest Steel Mill. That is on the south side of the city near I-25. News 5's Andy Cohen has been in Pueblo all afternoon monitoring both of these fires. He's joining us live tonight from the Everest Steel Mill. Andy, what do you know? Well, Diane, Evraz has its own fire brigade, and they have been working alongside Pueblo firefighters to try and put out this structure fire, which has been burning for a couple of hours now. Our chief photojournalist, Adam Knappick, is a certified drone pilot, and we flew our drone a little bit earlier this afternoon to give you a bird's eye view of this emergency. We want to share that video with you now. We can tell you that a spokesperson with Evraz North America says that the fire is burning in a building that was primarily used for staging and storage. They say all of Evraz's employees were safely evacuated, they are accounted for, and that the Pueblo Fire Department remains on scene working to put this fire out. Now, multiple sources who are familiar with the layout of the steel mill tell me that the building that's burning is the old Davis Wire Mill. Davis Wire has not manufactured its wire products here for many years. Embers, though, from this structure fire caused a number of spot fires to flare up just to the east of here. Fire crews were putting out grass fires. They were also protecting homes and businesses in the Salt Creek neighborhood and along South Santa Fe Avenue. The sheriff's office issued a pre-evacuation notice for all homes in the 1000 to 1100 block of Palo Alto Street in Salt Creek. It's certainly been a very busy day for Pueblo firefighters. Uh, they have uh, had a lot of stress and pressure on them as they are working to handle these multiple emergencies. And we do know that there have been a lot of additional firefighters from throughout Southern Colorado who are here helping to fight these fires and join alongside those uh, firefighters in putting out these fires. Reporting live in Pueblo, Andy Cohen, News 5.